just right out of the gate, just what was it like to be back and to be able to make such a big contribution right out of the gate? I mean, everything, to, to be honest. Uh, you know, I was battling an injury, uh, a lot of uncertainty during that injury. I didn't know when I was going to be back. Uh, I just put it in God's hand. And tonight, uh, just tell myself, just be bold, be courageous, and let God handle the rest. You know, and uh, I made place for the team. Fuck. Yeah, AJ, you guys have been through some serious stuff over the last 16 days since you guys played a game. Uh, what what does this win mean to you, even though, you know, it's only four games or five weeks into the season? Um, I think the team mindset is just another game, to be honest. Um, yeah, we had to deal with some uh, certain stuff, but, you know, that, that would come – that, that's like life, you know. Uh, curveballs, he throws you all the time. You got to deal with certain stuff. You got to keep on moving. So, uh, us getting his win was just just what we expected to do. Uh, come on and play hard, play physical. That's a great team over there. You know, shout out to them. Um, but uh, we just try to come out and just do what we do. John Glennon. Yeah, AJ, I mean, uh, sort of following up on, on Bucks there, I mean, how impressive is this as a, as a team to be able to do this? I mean, you guys have had three practices in 16 days, you know, haven't played in weeks, and just kind of cruise out there and, and knock around an undefeated team. Uh, I don't know. Uh, is that impressive to you? Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm a very humble guy. Uh, so, I mean, you're going to get the same answer out of me. Um, like I said, we we just we expect to win every time we go out there. We we get a chance to play, we expect to win, no matter who we playing. Uh, so that's just our, our look on the game, you know. Regardless of what we was going through, like through the week, like none of that matter. You got to find a way, you know. So that was our motto. Uh, the whole week we gonna find a way. They let us play, we are gonna play. TD. Yeah, AJ. Can you kind of take me through the, the, the rehab process for you? Because I know it had to be difficult not being able to be in the facility this last week. Uh, how did you manage to get ready to go for today? I kind of uh, – <laughs> funny story. I kind of did more than I, what I was supposed to. <clears throat> uh, to be honest, they didn't expect me to be back uh, this soon. Uh, but during the time I couldn't go in the building, I'd go to a field. Um, <clears throat> i go to a field. i run routes and just to see where I'm at. And uh, and I ice I ice my knees like every hour. I mean every like every thirty minutes into the hour, like I'm icing it, icing it, because I'd be sore afterwards or whatnot. But um, I kind of did more than I expected. And I came back and I told Todd, I'm uh, uh, I think I'm uh, I think I'm doing a lot better than, than a lot of people think. So uh, I want to give it a go. You know what I'm saying? Like um, I have good days, I have bad days. You know, uh, so. And they had a veteran corner on you and basically cat coverage and you still did what you did after missing two games. Do you feel like that was kind of a statement that you needed to make to, to show that, you know, you shouldn't be a guy that, that draws cat coverage? Um, <laughs> to be honest, I, I all that, all that, all that stuff handles me. So um, I was, uh, I was able today to go out there and make some plays on a really good corner. Um, uh, I let God handle all that other stuff. I, don't, I let people talk for me. You know, I got to talk for myself. Terry? AJ, how much did you work even harder to get back knowing that the Titans wouldn't have Corey or Adam tonight? I kind of I put it on me. Uh, <clears throat> just just seeing those guys uh, end up being out, I kind of put it on myself. Um, because during the week, I was kind of having like a bad week. I was having a bad week, and I told myself I'm going this week. I'm going this week, so uh, I have to. You know, uh, a lot of guys, lean, a lot of people like depending on me. Uh, and uh, Brian just kept, <clears throat> Brian just kept talking to me. Uh, we need you. We need you this week. We need you this week. And uh, I just told, told myself I'm going, and that's that's that. Paul. Hey, AJ, I know you weren't there for the first two, but that's 106 points in three games for you guys. Uh, is, is that now the standard? Should, be, you, should you guys be scoring 30 or more a week? Uh, every time we touch the ball, we expect our score. Uh, I, don't, I don't know about them stats. 
but every time we can touch the ball, we expect to score. So, Kyle. Yeah, before you guys took the field, I think you came out of the tunnel. It was a, a huddle of wide receivers. It was you and three undrafted guys. Um, you know, and those guys had to do more than they normally do. A lot of people had to do more than normal. Uh, I was curious just about what you all said to each other or what you said to them coming out and what you thought of those guys and, and how they rose to the occasion. Um, I told those guys, uh, when we lead this game, we need to be mentally and physically exhausted. There's only four of us. And, and, and that's all we need, no matter where you come from, no matter none of that stuff matter. Um, you can't mess a heart, and that's what we that's what we brought to the, to this game, our heart. Um, so um, it was only four of us. We rotated a lot. You know, shout out to those guys for helping me out because I couldn't breathe half of the time. But uh, <laughs> uh, but shout out to those guys uh, lifting each other up, playing as a group, as a unit. You know, we we did really well. Luke. AJ, you all talk a lot about the belief that you have in each other and, and in this team. I think we maybe saw why that is a little bit tonight. But, but what is it about this team that, that is so special and, and that leads you all to have the belief that you do? Um, when you go through things, you grow through things, to be honest. Uh, prime example, what we just dealt with, um, we stayed together as a team. Uh, we communicated. We zoom a lot. Uh, we just try to stay on, stay on top of things, you know. We just try to keep a, a keep positive mindset, and that's what we did. And uh, I definitely feel like this this little whole little episode of COVID or whatever definitely made us closer. So. Is the sky the limit for this team? Do you think? <clears throat> Sky's the limit. <laughs> Jared. Yeah, AJ. I, I know you don't get too caught up in stats or anything like that, but. Ryan never puts up the stats that wow people. And yet you guys keep winning with him as quarterback and beating guys like Lamar Jackson, who won the MVP award last year, or even Josh Allen today, who people were talking about maybe an early MVP type player. Do you think that Ryan's value when you're talking about most valuable or high end quarterback, do you think that gets lost simply because he doesn't throw for a lot of passing yards? And how do you feel about his value at that position in this league? Uh, Ryan's a really good quarterback. Uh, he may not come out and throw for like 500 or whatnot, um, like other guys, but um, we can't win. You know, that's what it comes down to. We're not here for any visual stat. We here to compete as, as a unit, go out and do it as, as a unit. Um, so uh, whenever we have a big game, uh, who cares if you don't throw for 500? As long as we get the win, we do what we need to be do what needs to be done. All that matter. All that. So uh, that's the only thing that matters. So. Um, I don't know about to the league, but he's definitely valuable to our team. He's a general. Uh, he's a head man in charge. And he leads us. He's a great leader. So, Last one, Jim. Hey, Jay, what's the challenge now of recovering from this one and now getting ready to play a game here in about five days? Uh, uh, I don't know about for other guys, but I'm about to go get in the cold tub like tonight, like a couple of times. <laughs> Uh, but we definitely going we definitely going to recover uh try to shake back uh, uh watch this film and uh try to clean up the little things and uh, get back out the price and clean it up man move forward you know so we got a, we got a big game coming up to be in the game so uh, 